Well, we've been out at dinner on the dock at Prairie Street Brew House throughout the summer, but today we're talking about a different meal at the brew house. Brunch on the Dock is their annual fundraiser for Family Counseling Services in Rockford. Stacy Lidval, the board of director for FCS, is joining us now on what we can expect this weekend. I'm so excited that you're bringing this event back. What can people expect for the menu? Obviously, this is supporting a great cause, but people are very excited about the food. What can people expect on the menu this year? Well, it's a uh, buffet-style brunch, so if you go online and buy tickets, you can expect a bunch of food that uh, Prairie Street will put out, um, anything from eggs and French toast to different meats and uh, fruits, um, all kinds of things, and of course, they're full bar, so feel free to go grab a mimosa or a Bloody Mary and enjoy us on the deck. Uh, music by Don't Tell Mom, so mm. it's a really nice, um, just easy-going morning. Yeah, it sounds very exciting. We always talk about food here on The Morning Show, and it always makes me <laughs> so hungry. So I know you guys have some prizes offered to people who are buying tickets, too. What can people expect to win? Well, we do door prizes, so, I mean, just showing up, you could possibly uh -huh. win um, a Mosa basket, or we have some jewelry out there. We also do uh, raffle baskets, so purchase a few tickets and try your hand at some of our baskets. Um, I know we have some yard games. We have, uh, I think, a... Uh, milkshake package and all just different kinds of eclectic packages going on so sounds very delicious right. you had mentioned to me off camera something about bartenders oh yeah this thursday actually if you want to come out to prayer or excuse me to the pomodoro from six to eight we're also doing a guest bartending event actually just lips in with the evening news is going to be one of our bartenders along with jenny voss from evolve dance and then steve summers over at the bowl and you can actually show up, and if you let any one of our bartenders know that you're there to support family counseling, you will be entered in a drawing to win tickets to this brunch on Sunday. All right, that's awesome. We'll see Jess there. That's exciting. So let's talk about the brunch again on Sunday, uh, raising money for an important cause. What kind of services are they benefiting? Uh, family Counseling Services is a local nonprofit organization, and we provide a bunch of counseling services and menagerie of anything from family counseling, domestic violence counseling, um, substance abuse counseling, to members of our community who may or may not have the actual means to pay for their services. They might have insurance that might not cover services. They might not have any insurance whatsoever. So we raise our funds to um, cover the costs of their health care. We offer this on a sliding scale basis and no one has ever turned away for inability to pay. How important is the need right now in the community for services like these? I mean, we're on a wait list. So, I, you know, it's it's been growing, especially before COVID even. Mm. And COVID has just launched this into a big need for mental health. People are taking care of themselves and they realize now that it's not just the physical aspect of your health care that's important. Um, people need to be healthy on a whole, mental and physical, and I'm very glad that we can provide these services and open these doors that might not be existing for people. What is it like for you personally to know that you're helping people? That's why we do what we do. It's, um, it, it's, just, it, it's important to me. So. Yeah. yeah, I can tell. All right. <laughs> well, it's a very fun event. People are going to yeah. be brought together for food and supporting a great cause. Don't miss it. Yeah, once again, yes. brunch on the dock benefiting family counseling services will be this Sunday at Prairie Street Brew House starting at 10 in the morning, going through 1 in the afternoon. We'll see you in just a little bit.